Hey, it's Jason Lynette, and we're here talking hypnotic business systems, and I'm here with my favorite hypnotist, please tell the others, Karen Hand. Karen, how are you? I'm great, Jason, and the feeling is mutual, of course. You are my favorite as well. You're just the best. Oh, thank you. So before we hop in, for those that don't yet know you, could you briefly introduce yourself, please? Sure. I am a full-time hypnotist. I work in Chicago, Illinois, and globally because I do most of my business on Zoom. I'm a board-certified hypnotist and a trainer and an author. Which uh, you and I go back quite a ways, and you've actually been inside of uh, business systems for quite a bit. And as we're gathering a few uh, folks to hear some specific feedback, are there specific modules that you've put into use and found uh, some strength from? I find strength from it all the time. The, the latest that I went into, I tend to be a little bit old school. I still pass around a clipboard instead of Jason's fancy <laughs> iPad signups. But whenever I need to do something new or look at a new concept, business systems is my first stop. And I wanted to do some new um, search engine optimization for my site. And I thought, you know what, just let me check business systems. I don't know if there's anything new there. Just let me check. And I went and duh, it had just been updated in March. Yeah. And I just, it floors me because every time I go, there is something new. There's nothing outdated. It just keeps getting updated and, and redone and new stuff coming in. That's what I like most. Well, I give some of the background on that, that the whole thing was, again, modeling the systems that are actually working. The whole uh, catchphrase in that section is guessing sucks. <laughs> Here's the real data. No, and it's where the, the ultimate sales conversation begins in the language of the consumer in the problem, but it ends in the language of the expert in the solution. So, so much of it came down to, I, I stumbled upon this resource of, oh, look, here's the top 1,000 words that people have typed into the web to find Virginia hypnosis. Love that too. Yes. I know, right? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it's the moment where I was jealous of the program that I put out. I was like, man, I wish I had this. <laughs> And as we rebuilt the new Virginia Hypnosis website, that became the foundation. It's like, well, here are the words in the specific order that people use them. And let's just write around that. Right. I find everything on there useful and it keeps moving me, upgrading me into something that is even, oh my gosh, and now there's this. Oh, I didn't even think about that. So you answer an awful lot of questions for me. I, I really appreciate it. And I think we did a survey, which is what's prompting uh, these quick interviews here. You mentioned around having different pages for different items and seeing a result from that. Yes. I, I really appreciate having the ease at which I can learn something from you and then trans, translate it into something that I can do. So yes, it's all there. All the, yeah. pages, all the different outlets. Which let's, let's turn that into a quick teaching module here that so many people are confused about what to put on a website. And if we pick a specific niche market, does that now limit us? And the answer is you can actually pick several. You know, so the strategy that I say, and you can see this in action on Karen's website, you can see it on mine, where I have different pages for different items. So someone sends a message and wants information about this one thing, we can send them directly to that piece of content, which then delivers what they're looking for, other than, you know, they're trying to find about overcoming a fear of flying and you're sending them to a weight loss ad. Right, right. Wow. <laughs> one of the things I definitely did learn is that if I segmented in that way, I I like to think I'm a generalist because I like to work with all different things, yes, but I, I learned from you that I can still niche it up. So I have niche pages on my website that certain people go to or are attracted to. Doesn't change the business at all. It just attracts people to me in a different way. And I learned that from you. I appreciate it. Well, it's kind of a way of building different conversations with people that if they're finding what they're looking for, then they're willing to go further. If they're not finding what they're looking for, they're going to stop looking is the downfall. Or, have you noticed any sort of result from that since plugging that in? Well, yes. <laughs> I have a page on the virtual gastric band procedure, uh, mm -hmm. Sheila Granger's procedure that I learned from you. And I don't want to really specialize in that. So I resisted for quite a while putting up the page, but I thought, let's put it up there and see what happens. I get a lot of weight loss clients who don't want virtual gastric band, but yeah. when they see that I can do that, oh my gosh, can you help me with this over here? So yes, it was really niched, as you said it would, <laughs> and it expanded to even more business. Thank you for that tip. <laughs> absolutely, absolutely. No, it's again, giving them that through line of here's the information, here's an option, and to see that they can do that, they can do something else. All of this becomes a whole lot more flexible that way, which the beauty is that's now an asset that's done. Here's like something else I learned from you, Jason. 
You always over deliver. And that's one thing that I'm impressed with, that I model, that I always do. And when I go to hypnotic, hypnosis business systems or any of your pages, even Virginia hypnosis, what I discover is I learn something every time because you always over deliver in your presentation, in the material you provide, in everything. And I really appreciate that. In fact, I sometimes just go to your website to model what you're doing because I pick up something new every time. Well, the, the backstory to all of this was that, you know, I left one of my original trainings going, okay, I, I know a lot of great techniques as a hypnotist, but now how do I put it all together? And then in the shape of running the business, seeing that there was that need that was out there and just to give people the model of what's working. And, and you've heard me say this before that it's this complete safety to teach exactly what's working right now. Why? Because you can't do it the way that I do it because you shouldn't, you should do it the way that you do it. But to give the level of detail, the attention, the specifics, even some of the software recommendations just to go here, watch this, do that. Or even better here, hire an outsourcer and have them watch this video. Yes, <laughs> that's exactly what I did. I can't carry off all the things that you say, but I can have my webmaster look at it and say, that's what I want. Do that. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> Outstanding. It's all the way around. And, you know, modeling excellence, I really want to say that again, modeling excellence. Every time I go to one of your sites, that's what I get. Yes, you give me complete explanations, but if I read between the lines, if I watch how you do it, if I look at how professionally it's put together, I learn even more just by modeling excellence. Well, thank you. Thank you. Yeah, we were chatting before we just hopped on and just to highlight a message that I've now received from like a dozen people that there's a segment that we just recently added where like one of the videos is like the screenshot here, watch me set this up. And I got so much feedback. It's where I'm also learning from the community what they want, what they need help with. And the highlight was there's a moment that I said in a video, watch this entire thing first. It's a bit technical, so watch it first so you understand the user experience. But then rewind back to the beginning. Remember rewinding? Go back to the beginning <laughs> of the video. Um, and then that way you don't have to pay Blockbuster the $2 penalty fee. So back to the video and then step by step build it along with me, which that kind of feedback immediately informed because there's, there's more stuff coming in over the next couple of months to go. There's the delivery mechanism. That's how we make it easy for people to get out there, help more people and grow their businesses specifically in uh, what I was looking for, for search engine optimization, what I appreciated was I got an overview of what was coming up. And then when I got to look down, I could target right in on what I specifically needed at the moment and then could send something else to my web designer. It's yeah. perfect. It's great. Awesome. Well, thank you so much for joining me here. Any other thoughts for folks out there looking to build their hypnotic businesses? You know, I've got to tell you, best presenter, best businessman, probably... I would say number one in our industry, Jason Lynette. Thank you very much for providing the excellence that I get to copy. Appreciate it.